Is this taken? <laughs> no. It's beautiful out. Yeah. Patrick, can I be honest? Sure. You interest me. I'm, I'm sorry? You interest me. I... I interest you. <clears throat> it sounds funny even to me, but... Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you see them? Uh-huh. I didn't think there'd come a time when guys like that didn't interest me. But I was wrong. Lately, I've been thinking about guys like you. Can I show you something? Sure, sure. What is it? A short story. You're the first person I've shown it to. You're an English major, so I respect your opinion. Would, would you look at it? You want, you want my, my feedback? Mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna go read it. I'll be right here. Can you be so insecure? <clears throat> I I love it. I, I'm I'm blown away. I the 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 writing and and, and the dialogue. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh. Uh, uh, I, 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 I'll get it. Please. I don't understand. You could have faked that. The orgasm? Of course. No, the tape. Please. Sad. You could have used this to make a little life for yourself. You know, you're only halfway home. Christopher's coming over later. I'll be home by midnight. I'll be in touch. So the key to a good polo pony is one that is small and agile. Fifteen hands is quite perfect. Really? That's fascinating. Yeah, um, the ponies I had at Eaton were between 15 and 16 hands, and we never lost a match. Eaton? So, you know Prince William? Yeah, Wills was in my house with me. He's an excellent player, you know. Do you know him? We've only met a few times, mostly at charity functions. You know, I think his grandmama makes him go to those. Yes, we both love to give money away. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here, Christopher. Yeah, I'm not used to young ladies being quite so forward. I'm not complaining. I'm sure it's no one. So are you liking the States? Excuse me. Right, so. What's going on? 
Excuse me? What does it look like? A date. Uh, forgive me, Patrick, is it? What? I barely know you. What are you doing in my room? Cassidy, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with me? I've spoken two words to you in my entire life. <laughs> what? This must be some sort of mistake, Christopher. Yes, evidently. <laughs> Cassidy. I'd like you to leave. Christopher, I, I I don't know I don't know why you're you're here or, or what Cassidy told you, but Cassidy and I just made love a few hours ago. Well, I should probably go. No. Not 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 until you've had a chance to judge her for yourself. To judge her? Look, it's it's Cassidy's purse. You've seen her wearing it. Open it. And look for a tape recorder. <coughs> and and Cassidy's wallet. I'm not going to investigate her. What? What, what, what do you know? I, I, I think Christopher will be interested in this. <laughs> Good God. It's, it, it's the $10,000 that Cassidy took to do what you just heard. <clears throat> this is extraordinary. Christopher, I can explain. No, not the time. <clears throat> so how does it feel to be used? You know better than anyone. So we're even. Well, we're even, all right. Shit. Well, well, well. What's wrong with you? Look at you, with your tight ass and your perfect little tits. You still don't get it, do you? Get what? You wouldn't give a guy like me the fucking time of day. But you sure gave it to me this afternoon. Jason told you to do this. No, oh, Jason didn't tell me to do this. I told Jason to do this. What? Well, it looks like you lost your bet on Christopher. He sure as hell isn't sleeping with you now. But you know what? Don't give Jason the money. Give it to me. Because it wasn't Jason's money to begin with. It was mine. OK, I'll slow down. I arranged the whole thing. The nerd act, the challenge, the two bets. The bet on me gave me the chance to bang you. The bet on Christopher gave me the chance to win my $10,000 back. All I needed was a partner. Someone who knows what it's like to feel rejected. Hey, Toots. You fuckers. Honestly, from experience, I'm not sure you're worth $10,000, but you're a hell of a freebie. I should have known you couldn't afford that. So, what did you get out of this? One look at the expression on your face. Do you believe I found someone as awful as you? I mean, come on. What are the chances? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and by the way, your story. <laughs> <laughs>